visit, as I have said, is since they were appointed, there were no real induction done. And we did not really come down and see whether they have settled into their offices, what are the challenges that they are facing, what are the success stories that they can tell. When you have a face-to-face -face interaction with governors, you can solve problems and challenges on the spot and um, uh, issues that they are battling with. What I must say, however, of Omaheke is that Omaheke seems to be moving away from the traditional way of, of, of providing food for themselves. You know, Omaheke was traditionally known as a cattle producing country. Uh, uh, yeah, we, we, we mentioned it as we say cattle country, but Omaheke was uh, normally known traditionally as a cattle producing region. But it is impressive to see how the Omaheke farmers are venturing out from the traditional way of doing farming and they are diversifying their farming activities into crop production. And this is very, very impressive to see how, how small farmers, how um, not only government uh, aided farmers, but private farmers are also venturing out into crop production. We give this one to the president. Mm -hmm. I think the minister will hand it over to him yeah. yes. to say that uh, your people are doing very well mm -hmm. with your garden. So we are, we are give it to him. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. Wow. Wow, look at this. Oh. Is this a wow. wow. <laughs> 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 this is from the so huge. I think this one now, he expanded because it was only a small thing. Mm, mm, mm. Uh -huh. So you just open there. You open here? Yeah. yeah. And just if you close there, it also closes. Yeah, it's also close. Oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 then after that, the project can become so sustainable. Where the young people, the school learners, they go with a, a poor cup, mm. cabbage head, mm. to home. From it's school. From school to yes. home. Yes. Carrots from school to home. Mm. So the school starts feeding a community. Mm -hmm. What I must say, however, of Omaheke is that Omaheke seems to be moving away from the traditional way of, of, of providing food for themselves. You know, Omaheke was traditionally known as a cattle producing country. Uh, 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 yeah, we, we, we mentioned it as we say cattle country, but Omaheke was uh, n normally known traditionally as a cattle producing region. But it is impressive to see how the Omaheke farmers are venturing out from the traditional way of doing farming and they are diversifying their farming activities into crop production. And this is very, very impressive to see how, how small farmers, how um, not only government uh, aided farmers, but private farmers are also venturing out into crop production. And this is ginger. Ooh. Uh -huh. Wow. This is ginger. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This onions are overgrown. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just can use it for the whole week. <laughs> Incubation hub should encourage. Mm -hmm. So that we improvise on that. That means what we are doing, we just 